Armenia, the Silicon Valley of the former USSR, a country where high technologies have always evolved to keep up with the times. How did this all start? The National Academy of Sciences, established in 1943, this institution carries out and supervises fundamental and applied research in different disciplines, uniting around 40 research institutions. The Computer Research and Development Institute. This institution used to be the biggest center for development of computer equipment and automatic control systems. One of the first computers in the world, and the very first one in the USSR, Nairi 2, was produced right here. The Institute of Physics. It's here that international level theoretical and experimental research on elementary particles and nuclear physics are conducted. The Polytechnic University, this huge center of technical sciences, is one of the leading institutions of high technologies in the region. It is a recognized and distinguished university, not only in Armenia, but also beyond its borders. Who are the initiators of high technologies? We found a solution to a 70-year-old fundamental problem in mathematical theory. We were one of the pioneers who created the remote control helicopter. We are among the founders of theoretical astrophysics. We are now moving ahead towards ambitious plans and perspectives of the future. Over the last seven years, the revenue of Armenian technological companies has grown by five times, with an annual average rate of about 25%. The role of the Armenian government in the growth of this industry is crucial. Research and development centers of various multinational high-tech companies are located in Armenia. Synopsis, the Armenian branch of the company designed the USB-3. National Instruments is ranked among the 100 best employers in the world, and one of their trending engineering centers is located in Armenia. Armenian Engineering Labs, known as ONEL, started to function with the support of this organization, Cisco Armenia. Using advanced technologies, the Armenian branch of this company designs and develops Cisco's leading network chips. Many Armenian high-tech companies are now acknowledged internationally. Pixart. More than 100 million people all over the world edit almost 850 million pics during a month in this application. Pixart, the biggest photo editing app in the whole world. SoloLearn is the biggest mobile platform for teaching programming, which is among the fastest developing companies in the world. Ya yeah Engineering is a company that provides a full range of engineering services, from design to manufacturing of devices, systems, and automated test equipment for advanced industrial applications. The list of these companies can be continued with many other Armenian startups, which are conquering the world market and are also leading with the rate of female employment in the sector. In 2019, Armenia will host a number of international and local conferences. Come to Armenia, the land of revolutionary opportunities.